Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today I'm doing another recipe that was sent to me by a subscriber. This one comes from Leanna Estep. And I apologize, Leanna, if I'm not saying your last name correctly, but this is her Granny Bessie's Banana Nut Bread. So it's quite different than the recipe I normally use to make banana bread. So I'm very interested to see how this turns out. So let's get started. So this recipe is really quite simple. You just have two cups of self-rising flour, two cups of sugar, three eggs, a three-quarter cup of pecans chopped, a cup of oil, and five ripe bananas. And it's very simple. It's just like most banana breads. You want to peel your bananas and then mash them up in a bowl. And then add in your wet ingredients. <laughs> there goes my <laughs> notification on my phone. I don't know if you guys could hear that, but... Um, anyway, so yeah, mash up your bananas in the bowl and then add in your eggs, sugar, and oil, and then your flour, and then pour it into some greased muffin pans, and then we're going to bake it. Let's take it slow, where you go, I go to, and if you hit the bottom, I'm going down with you. Let's take it slow, who cares where we go? And here's what these are looking like as they are ready to go into the oven. And Leanna said it's important to cook these low and slow. Um, I believe she said 300 degrees for 60 to 90 minutes. Um, I probably needed to do mine at 325 because just the RV oven doesn't work as good. As you can see, too, my centers collapsed because I think we slammed the door a couple of times while they were baking. But... <laughs> Yeah, so mine definitely took about 90 minutes at 300 in the RV oven, but I think next time I make it, I'll do it at 325, and it'll probably take an hour. But seriously, delicious, guys. Okay, it's still cooling off, but I had to sneak a piece and try it. It is so good. Oh my word. Granny Bessie knew what she was doing. It is delicious. Um, it's really sweet. It's almost like a dessert. It's amazing. 